There we go. Oh, and luckily it doused the flames. Oh, I'm just smashing everything up. Unfortunately, Wayne didn't carry a spare bat suit in that secret room we just entered, and I'm not entering through there. So, still can't glide, just running around in my tux. Okay, lots of fire. Ooh, I can actually do something with this. Ah, okay, I hit a fire extinguisher or something down below. Not going that way, not going that way. Down, then. Okay, buddy, it's just you and me, so I'm not going to allow you to hit me, not even once. It's a fearsome sword you've got. Wish I could take it. And you're done. Okay, let's move back. That door will probably set itself on fire the moment I get close. Nope. Ah, it's just, I just can't go through it for some reason. It's my house, but I don't have the keys for all the doors. I mean, obviously. Okay, jump where there's no fire. Be nice and careful. Oh, he's on the other side. Oh, Lucius. Okay, got a savior. Fox, Lucius, what are you still doing here? I was nearly killed by some maniac in black pajamas. You have to get out of here. We need to manufacture your neurotoxin antidote on a large scale. That would take weeks. We don't have weeks. The toxin's already been dispersed. It's in our water supply. That doesn't make any sense. The toxin's an inhalant. Putting it in the water wouldn't work. Unless... What? Unless you had a microwave emitter powerful enough to vaporize the whole system. Kind recently stolen from Wayne Enterprise. Stay there! I'll find a way out for you! So that's what that big robbery closer to the beginning of the game was all about. So they could turn all the water in the pipes and the sewers and just everywhere into steam. Ooh, oh, jeez, jeez, jeez. Okay, let's... Well, I wanted to blind the guy behind, but unfortunately uh, it's a little bit difficult turning around in this game. A little bit difficult to turn when you're already fighting one guy. He tries focusing on them. Yeah, get back down. There we go, just you and me. Yep, stand up so I can knock you back down. Go on, get up. I don't think I've humiliated you quite enough just yet. There we go. Now you're humiliated. And nothing else to do in this room, so let's... No, you're not. Oh, it's blocked from the other side and cannot be opened. How do I get to him then? Aha! Okay, so I've opened up a path for me. Jeez, I was trying to throw a batarang at that, but it wouldn't let me, so I had to run forward, hit it. I accidentally bumped myself ever so slightly. But don't worry, Lucius, I'll be with you in a moment. Hopefully I'm not on, like, an invisible time limit or something. Don't worry, Lucius. I'll save you. I will. I'll just make this jump and actually properly make it this time. There we go. Okay, some more health. I, uh, th this has got to be the right way, but I feel like I'm leaving Lucius to burn. No, no, no. I, I must figure out another way to get to him. Like so. Man, I have to be pretty damn close. Aha, done. Knocked the doors open. Well done. Now save your own hide. I will. And you have to be pretty damn close to use the batarang sometimes. Okay. Blind the two of you. Now please only hit one of them. Damn it, knock the other guy out of that status. Oh well. 
Just keep doing multi-attacks the second I see it pop up. And we're fine. We're golden. No more gadgets left, unfortunately. But, uh... We'll make do. We'll make do. And then 20 Alfred, ninjas. Are you still alive? No, sir, but loyal as always. Waiting by the piano. I'll be there. And then 20 ninjas suddenly jump into the room. And man, you need to pay for a better sprinkler system or something. That's always weird in games. The uh, sprinklers never go off because of heat, because of fire. You have to hit them with something. That's not how they work. Okay, Alfred. You okay? I hope you didn't brush your mic out, sir. Well, no. You've been perfectly safe here whilst I've been fighting my way through an army of ninja. Tomorrow the world will watch some horror as its greatest city destroys itself. Time to spread the word. And the word is... Panic. Oh yeah, that's some crazy amounts of panic. So they're enacting their plan to spread fear and chaos throughout the city. Let's put a stop to it. Oh yeah, suiting up. So hopefully we'll be more prepared for this onslaught. We'll be using the train. The monorail follows the water maze to the central hub beneath Wayne Tower. Chaos on Narrows Island. Hopefully we'll have a ton of gadgets in play. Sir, there appears to be a panic about the Narrow Pirate Bridge. There's a panic about the entire island. Ra's al Ghul's already vaporized the toxin. Of course, sir. But the crisis at hand is keeping it from spreading into Gotham proper. Someone is lowering the Narrow Pirate Bridge. Mobs poisoned by Crane's toxin could spill into the city. I'll stop the bridge. I'll put the control tower on your radar. And the uh, Batmobile? It stays on the tracks. The monorail can't reach Gotham without crossing that point. If I can't stop the train, the Batmobile's auto-destruct is my failsafe. So hopefully we'll have a ton of gadgets in play from the very beginning. Never mind, we've just got one flashbang. So that scene of him suiting up, making sure he's got tons of gadgets strapped to his belt. Yeah, never mind that. He's just got the one... Oh, God damn it! Well, that went well. That went extremely well. Uh, I was tapping L1 to launch out one of those flashbangs. Blind these guys. And unfortunately, just as I started pressing it, I guess the area fear went down enough that flashbang would no longer be effective. So uh, Batman didn't throw it, and instead he just stood still and allowed himself to get windmilled on by these guys. Okay, flashbang now. Jeez. Ah, uh, yeah. As I said, these guys' tactics of just flailing around, windmilling their fists, is actually pretty damned effective. So much so that just windmilling their fists around. Oh, Julie's. Okay, just uh, having a little bit of trouble focusing on which enemy I wanted to fight. Batman was going to one when I wanted to hit the other. Um. Yeah, those three highly trained ninja, all their tactics and everything, did worse against me than these guys just flailing around. So, if you ever get into a big old fight and you're not sure what to do, just windmill your fists, flail around like crazy. It's better than any sort of training or tactics you could possibly get. Okay, so now I have two flashbangs. And let's heal... Up and... Uh, uh, I probably should have just ignored this area. Just run forwards, vault it over this, climb the ladder, get the hell out of here. Oh god. Well, that's half my health gone. Or almost. So let's climb up this, get towards the bridge. And once again... Batman can't just grapple hook to absolutely anything he wants to. We need to take more advantage of the environment. Climb ladders and chains and go up elevators. 
the true stealthy superhero's way of doing things. Just hop into an elevator, head on up, job done. Okay, so guy with his back tuck. I was going to say, is he wearing a suit? And, and yeah, top left, that scarecrow. What are you doing here, buddy? Batman, come to join my tea party. Cray. Oh no, scarecrow. A few more minutes and the bridge will be down and Gotham will have so many more psychopaths than just you and I. I'm through playing games, Crane. Life is a game. So yes, maybe you are. Oh jeez. I mean, Scarecrow's just blown himself up as well, hasn't he? And that should probably have killed us, but it's okay, it's okay. We'll, we'll just ignore that, it's fine. <laughs> yeah, Scarecrow should just be dead. He's, he's killed himself. And another three maniacs all running towards me at the same time. Perfect. Okay. Let's back away slightly, throw a flashbang. And now please just focus on this one guy. Don't accidentally move to hit one of the others. Wait for him to get back up. Okay, multi-attack. Jump. Oh god, for a second I thought um, my next punch didn't come out in time and I was about to get hit because I'm kind of wary of my health now. If those other guys manage to take off half my health and I'm fighting another three guys then it should come to stand that these guys can also take off the other half of my health and I'll suddenly be in quite a lot of danger. Come on, mob! Oh, jeez, I can't believe he didn't do a multi-attack when stood between three enemies. Anyway, now it's two on one. Yeah, these maniacs just flailing around. It's it's a good tactic, very good tactic indeed. So I think I should start flailing around a bit. Yeah, what are you going to do against this? Okay, that didn't work and almost got hit in the back, so never mind, let's, let's take this seriously, because this is actually fairly difficult. Just a little bit difficult, too much for my liking. Making me wary, getting me nervous. Ah, oh, damn it. I, I, I think there's like invisible walls area everywhere. Uh, that should have knocked him off. Sent him to his death. Okay, you okay, buddy? Yeah, he's alive. He's probably crippled for life, but other than that, he's alive. So I'm not going to give you any medical attention, I'm just going to take your car and use it for my own purposes. Bye bye, as you twitch along the ground. Oh. Well, that's one way to open up a path. And, uh, yep. Sorry, I just completely totaled your car. And I'm not going to give you any help at all. I'm out of here. Oh, bye bye. Oh, come on, grappling hook point. Uh, I guess I'm too low. Ah, there we go. It busted this open so I can climb up to get high enough to use that grappling point. There we go. There we go. So, is Scarecrow still there? Because, yeah. It was such a force of an explosion as to send me flying out. Scarecrow was... Oh no, yeah. Green blip still there. Scarecrow was stood right next to it. He should be dead. I should just be arriving to... No, that's not... You're not human. A charred corpse. Stay away. Don't come any closer. It's not happening. I'm not afraid of you. I'm not afraid of you. Oh, yes, you are. I'm not afraid. Oh. Oh, so that's your excuse for just allowing him to go crashing out the window. Ow, oh, he'll probably be fine. I definitely didn't murder that guy. Okay, so we stopped the bridge from getting lowered. On to the next area. The monorail tracks. And as this is a new section, never mind. I'm going after Ra's al Ghul and the microwave emitter. 
I need any information you can find. Of course, sir. Still only got two segments. We don't have time. There are two more barriers after this, keeping them on a rail from Gotham. Then we'll use the explosives. Still only got two segments of health available to me, as it was a new section. Hoping for full health, but nope. <laughs> 